Welcome to another episode of Maximize Your Health. I'm your host, Dr. Josh Axe. Today, we're gonna to be talking about the top five foods all women must have in their diet. And to start us off, we're gonna start off here with flax seeds or flax meal. Now, flax seeds are loaded with something called omega-3 fats, and omega-3 fats are very important for reducing inflammation. They're very important for women for balancing hormones. Also, if you wanna have thicker hair, stronger nails, and more glowing skin, you're gonna to wanna to really load up on the omega-3 fats, and there are several ways to do that, but one of the best ways is through flax seeds or flax meal. Now, the way I do this is I do a berry smoothie for breakfast, and I put in some berries, some coconut milk, and then I'll add in about two or three tablespoons of flax meal or flax seeds. And these flax seeds are also very good for colon health, they're good for uh, healthy bowel movements, and again, number one thing, healthy skin, hair, and nails you're gonna get from doing more flax seeds. Now, the next food you wanna be getting are carrots, specifically organic carrots, are very, very good for your skin. They're packed with an antioxidant known as beta-carotene. And beta-carotene has also been shown to help darken your skin color. You know, it's funny, I notice people, I can tell when people are eating antioxidant-rich foods, because again, these carrots will give you a little bit more of an orange or even a, more of a bronze bronzish <laughs> tone to your skin there. It'll actually help darken up your skin a little bit, as well other antioxidant-rich foods. But carrots are one of the best. Also, they're loaded with a vitamin A, which is very, very important for healthy-looking skin. Get more carrots. Next one we want to be doing are blueberries. Now, blueberries are packed with an antioxidant known as bioflavonoids or flavonoids. And these flavonoids have been, uh, been shown to be very, very important at preventing cancer. So if you want to prevent cancer, you want to be eating more blueberries. Also, blueberries are very good for anti-aging. In fact, they're one of my top, uh, they're one of my number one um, antioxidant-rich foods that are good for anti-aging. So if you want to age slower as a woman, if you want to be 60 years old but looking more like you're 35, you really want to focus on getting more blueberries into your diet. And uh, the other thing about blueberries is compared to other fruits, they're lower in sugar, which is also a great thing. So again, get more blueberries. Next food on our list is spinach. If you're wanting to uh, build stronger bones. You know, the question I get from a lot of people is, well, where do I get my calcium from? One of your best sources of calcium are green leafy vegetables like spinach, and this is loaded with calcium. It's gonna help you build stronger bones. Also, spinach is great because it's alkaline. It's gonna help alkalize your body. It's gonna help reduce acidity. So if you're a female that tends to work out a little bit more, you're wanting to recover uh, faster from workouts, you're gonna to wanna to reduce the acid in your body by eating more spinach. It's gonna help alkalize everything in, your, everything in your body. And great ways to get spinach, I like cooking up Italian food and doing it like that. I like doing a salad for lunch. Typically, I'll use spinach as kind of my form of lettuce. And another thing you can do is, a lot of times, I'll take a handful of spinach and put it in my berry smoothie in the morning. And you do a handful of spinach in a berry smoothie, you're not going to really taste it. There's not a lot of taste there. The berries cover it up. So again, spinach is a great way to uh, actually, uh, you know, to kind of boost your health for women. Last food for women that's going to help boost your health is raw dairy products or goat's milk yogurt. Now, goat's milk yogurt, yogurt is specifically good because it's got good bacteria in there known as probiotics, and probiotics help increase digestive health, they, have with, they help with healthier looking skin. Also, probiotics help you absorb and digest other vitamins and minerals even better. So if you're getting, really getting the most from the vitamins you're taking, you wanna take probiotics with what you're taking because it's gonna help uh, kind of increase the assimilation of all these other vitamins and nutrients you're getting. So again, yogurt is great for getting good bacteria in your body. Also, and specifically, understand, I'm talking about goat's milk yogurt or raw yogurt here. If you're using some of those junk brands out there like the Dannon or just a regular kind of yogurt, um, it's really not that good for you. They go through a, pa a process called pasteurization, which, which basically damages almost all the vitamins, minerals, and nutrients there. So you wanna stay away from the pasteurized stuff. Goat's milk yogurt is typically just flash pasteurized. It's not near as bad. But if you can get a, a raw yogurt or a raw cheese or a goat's milk yogurt, and I know they have it at Whole Foods, so you can find it there, but that's gonna be packed with calcium. Also, it's got vitamin K2. 
Recent studies have shown that vitamin K may be even more important than calcium when it comes to building strong bones. So as a woman, you're gonna wanna get that vitamin K, which is very, uh, very important for healthy blood, healthy bones, and again, healthy skin, hair, and nails. So remember those top five foods for women. All women should be eating those foods on a daily basis. And thanks for watching another episode of Maximize Your Health.